An engineer who supports a groundbreaking automobile attempt said that traffic lights can be used in 20 years. Smart Mobility Living Lab Thomas Tompkins said that it is possible to bear a seismic change in the form of our roads. This is part of Surf City project to determine and overcome the obstacles for placement of autonomous vehicles in cities that end next month. It is believed that Britain's roadside infrastructure and vehicles are the first driverless technology attempt with their own systems Nissan Leaf cars. Left lane buses such as potential problems such as SMLL relay about the route about 270 cameras were installed en route. This allows cars to change the strips well before they encounter obstacles and create a softer traffic flow. Mr. Tompkin, president of the network, infrastructure and operation in SMLL, estimated that high specific road systems cost about £1 million per kilometre per kilometre, but claimed that a wider presentation containing more basic technology for a portion of the price. This is becoming a slightly more compelling cases of work, he said. If we think of maybe 20 or 30 years, can you start thinking about the outside infrastructure? Can you start lifting some of this infrastructure like traffic signals? Obviously, there is a lot of work to be done before it happens. Mr. Tompkins said he hoped that Britain will move too much to completely driverless cars in public use by the end of a decade. The British government had previously expressed the commitment to bring legislation that would enable the use of self-in on on-driven vehicles. Surf City's cars have a qualified driver behind the wheel that can seize control if necessary. A driver intervened at least twice during the media demonstrations in the beginning of this week to avoid possible collision by bus and miss pile of road surface. According to leaders of the project, cars did not have more than 1,600 miles of accidents during test Surf City. Nissan, Hitachi, Connected Places Catapult, University of Nottingham, TRL and £10.7 million of consortium projects including SBD Automotive.